Let's explore Autosar communication and the different communication protocols used to facilitate communication between electronic control units in vehicles. First up, we have CAN or Controller Area Network. CAN is the automotive industry's most widely used communication protocol to connect ECUs within a vehicle. It is a high-speed protocol capable of transmitting data up to 1 Mbps. CAN is reliable, easy to use, and can transmit data over long distances. For example, CAN connects the ECU to the transmission control unit, or the TCU, allowing them to communicate with each other and ensure optimal engine performance. Next up, we have LIN, or Local Interconnect Network. LIN is a low-speed protocol used to connect ECUs requiring less bandwidth. It is typically used for non-critical systems such as lighting and climate control. LIN is simple, cost-effective, and allows for easy implementation of new features. For example, LIN connects the instrument cluster to the radio in a vehicle, allowing the driver to control the radio through the instrument cluster. Finally, we have FlexRay, a high-speed protocol for advanced driver assistance systems, or the ADAS, and other safety-critical applications. FlexRay can transmit data at speeds of up to 10 Mbps and is designed to be fault-tolerant and deterministic. For example, FlexRay connects the sensors and ECUs in a vehicle's ADAS, allowing for real-time communication between the different systems and ensuring optimal safety. So, there you have it, the different communication protocols used in AutoSAR. As an engineer with one to two years of experience, it's essential to understand these protocols and how they are used in automotive software development. Stay tuned to this space for more interesting engineering content.